welcome to what will eventually be a whole shop. So I got it probably like a few weeks ago, or well, actually like a couple weeks ago. Um, in the process of getting permits. I got the layout, the electrical plan. I'm getting my AC plan put in because I have to put in like my whole AC unit. So I'm gonna have like 10 foot walls right here. This will be the break room. This will be the bathroom. And then all this will be the shop. I don't know what to do right here, but I'm assuming that they're just gonna patch that up and I don't know. But yeah, so this is the spot, guys. But yeah, it's big. It's a 1330 square foot. Right here is where my, my wall would be. And then the red caps are indications of where the barber chairs would be. Plan on having them seven feet apart, 10 barbers, five on each side. And right here, it seems like I'm gonna have to get the plumber to come out first so he can like fix all this up and then uh, do what he has to do. But definitely like a sink, sink right here, toilet right here, um, or maybe toilet right there, sink right here. I don't know, they'll figure it out. And then I'm debating on having another sink on the outside but I'm the first tenant here. New construction. It's gonna be exciting. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little stressful, but it's exciting. I never ever thought I would get to this point just because, man, a lot of hurdles. A lot, a lot of hurdles. My wife and I had to go through IVF uh, twice, twice. First one was a, was a rough one, but we have our daughter. She's one year old now, and that's pretty cool. I don't know. I don't want to say I didn't think that this was going to happen. I just, man, it's just so much stuff went into trying to get this place, like, like a lot. I looked at so many places. This one gave me the best deal out of all of them. Uh, and I guess I'm kind of like taking advantage of the whole COVID crisis just because, man, the rates right now, and you can't beat them. And that's like even for like, you know, trying to buy a house to, or trying to start a business. Like it's, it's pretty good. It's just, man, it's scary. <laughs> it's scary because you go for something so big and it's not a for sure thing if you're gonna be successful. It's just a leap of faith. And you know, without any risk, there's no success, so. It's gonna be a fun project. I definitely have put all the car stuff on hold. I'll definitely probably get back to that, but this will probably be the whole project right here. Let's get a side view of how big this place is. So yeah, that's it right here. And I'm like literally past halfway, right here. Yeah. So we're gonna do a shop vlog. It's gonna be fun. I feel like it's something different for the channel. Hopefully, anybody else that wants to start a barber shop can see what it takes. When it comes down to building a barber shop, I always see just the pictures, like flipping. I never really see the stuff that really goes through when it's like super detailed, but anything I come across, I definitely will record it. I have no idea who's gonna do the insulation in the ceiling, but hey, a lot of this stuff I'm just learning on the go. So peace, appreciate everyone for, you know, viewing everything. Please know none of this could have been possible without everyone that supported me in my business being a barber. Um, I want to thank every single one of y'all so much from the bottom of my heart. Um, welcome to our new home. Peace.